We've been coming to you this morning from the House Ways and Means Committee's hearing room here on Capitol Hill. You may not have heard of this room or this committee, but you should know that the committee deals with one of the primary functions of any government, taxes. And if these walls could talk, you'd hear stories about some of the best known figures in American history. Here before me stands stinking the moral carcass of the gentleman from Ohio. In the new movie, Lincoln, Tommy Lee Jones plays Thaddeus Stevens, a leading abolitionist and fiery Republican who served as chairman of the Ways and Means Committee during the Civil War. You are more reptile than man, George. Stevens is joined by eight presidents who served on the powerful Ways and Means Committee first, as did eight vice presidents and four Supreme Court justices. House historian Matt Wasniewski says in the 19th century, the Ways and Means chairman was the second most powerful person in the House after the Speaker. The role of Congress, uh, one of the primary roles is to raise revenue and, and expend that money on federal programs. And this is a committee that has a key role in that process. Wilbur Mills, who chaired the committee for 18 years, played a key role in implementing President Johnson's Great Society programs in the 1960s and was so influential, a colleague told the New York Times, I never vote against God, motherhood, or Wilbur Mills. The committee room was built in 1933 and designed to reflect the importance of the men who worked in it, with eagles and laurel wreaths and Greek columns. But all of those things are here on purpose. Farrar Elliott, the House curator, says the room actually served as the House chamber from 1949 to 1951, while the real one underwent renovations. We have all accounts of this room being very crowded and people coming in and just trying to find a seat anywhere. The committee has also seen its share of scandal. Wilbur Mills was pulled over for drunk driving in 1974 and his companion, a stripper named Fanny Fox, jumped out of the car and waded into the tidal basin. 